If your wife is being snipey with you, realize that what's happening is that she's starting to hold you in contempt. And you'll know it because she'll start rolling her eyes at you, say, oh yeah, well, whatever. And, and she'll just like completely disrespect what you have to say and not take you seriously. If this is happening, you have to nip that in the bud because that will unravel your relationship really fast. And the longer you let this contempt happen, again, the more she's going to do it. What you tolerate, you encourage in a relationship. Any relationship cannot happen without strong boundaries. In other words, hey, don't treat me this way. Treat me like a human being. So if that happens, you need to nip it in the bud and just start questioning her like hey what's going on why are you treating me like this why is this acceptable that you can roll your eyes at me and just let her know that that is not acceptable behavior and if she keeps pushing it then just don't deal with the person because that's not how you do it you may say well I'm married I have to deal with this person no you don't the problem is that guys they put the loyalty above a happy relationship the thing is is that she doesn't do that rarely does your wife look at the loyalty as the number one thing like well we're together we'll figure it out in the future no she's looking at you right now and saying hey can we make this work today and what's that gonna look like in the future and if it looks like it's not gonna happen then she's gonna start thinking about about our exit strategy. Whereas guys are like, well, we can rely on the commitment. We can rely on the marriage and we have our problems now, but we'll get them solved in the future. That's not the way to do it. For you as a man, as a husband, it's your job to take action now and resolve those problems and set the context of the relationship that says, this is a happy home where we talk about our problems and we deal with them like adults. We don't smash things. We don't talk to each other negatively. We don't call names. We don't even use bad tone of voice. Now you can get angry, you get upset, you can get upset at me, but you're not going to belittle me. You're not going to talk down to me or any of these types of things. A lot of the problems is guys have gotten themselves in a situation where they are just dealing with bad source material. They got with somebody that just doesn't want, want to communicate with them. And so what ends up happening is, is that they get tired of dealing with all the emotional trauma and they just capitulate and say, ah, it's just better to just let it go. And then those are the guys that end up hiring me to help solve their marriage problems. If you need help, Check me out at ed at genuineattraction.com.